Hi, happy Antibiotic Awareness Week. I'm Shalita Datani from the Canadian Pharmacists Association. Did you know that there are more than 23 million antibiotic prescriptions written for humans in Canada every year? Of those, we know that up to 50% could be just unnecessary. Using antibiotics when you don't need to can lead to resistance, which has become a global health problem. Antibiotic-related side effects are the cause of 20% of emergency department visits. We know that pharmacists, as the most successful healthcare professionals, are medication experts, and they can play a big role as antibiotic stewards, especially in community settings where the vast majority of antibiotics are prescribed. Let's walk through a case that's pretty typical for what you as a pharmacist might encounter. Let's talk about Dylan and his green gunky sputum. So mom comes into the pharmacy with her five-year-old son, Dylan. He's been coughing for five days with green mucus coming up. She's sure that this is an infection, so she asks you, what antibiotic should I ask my doctor to prescribe? Has Dylan been having any other symptoms or a fever? No, nope, he doesn't have a fever. He's really healthy otherwise, and he has no allergies. Well, you explain to her that this is actually probably a virus, which will run its course. Green, in this case, likely means that the virus is causing some inflammation in his throat and in his sinuses. And antibiotics don't do anything for viruses. Dylan might have symptoms for up to three weeks, so you ask her to be patient and to follow up with you in a few weeks. In the meantime, Dylan should drink lots of water, use a humidifier, and some acetaminophen or ibuprofen as he needs it for symptoms. Cough syrups don't tend to work very well compared to these other strategies. So mom and Dylan come back really happy in just a week to say thank you. Dylan is feeling much better and he didn't need antibiotics after all. Dylan had bronchitis and antibiotics are not recommended for acute uncomplicated bronchitis. Symptom management, TLC, and a great teachable moment were in order here and they worked. Another unnecessary antibiotic saved.